All right, so first off, thanks for the like support of that first part. Meant a lot to me. If you want more of this, just keep it up. I gotta say that God of War Ragnarok Valhalla. has actually been a lot better than I expected. Had more story stuff as well than I was expecting. So I'm not sure what happens when you rejoin. I guess we'll just try it out. Oh, you can just resume it. Okay. Ooh, I'm actually kind of happy. Because <laughs> this, let me see, if he wakes up again, it's going to be just like Returnal, I feel like, which is, you know, a roguelike game. I saw somebody say that this is actually a longer DLC than the Call of Duty campaign, which, you know, maybe it is. We'll see. I'm not sure if he just wakes up or not. Yep, okay. We always start here. Nice. So I completed that quest or whatever last time. So we're back on the shore at pretty much... Hey, the health bar is the same. Okay, woo! Our progress has been saved. Let's get it. Learning is a lifelong journey. Destination. Take that to heart. All right, so we got the cosmetic stuff. I'm just going to keep everything the way it is. Not really a fan of the other ones right now. Like some of these other ones, for sure. Some of these look insane. Like This one, it seems like there's the same type. They just change like the way it glows and stuff. Zeus. Man, those two look insane. Uh, I think we're good. Alright. So, it seems like you just kind of keep going. There are going to be story elements that keep popping up randomly. Between you and me, there's nothing wrong with enjoying the fight. Let me just check these out one more time. What do we got here? Resources. Divine Triumph. You can actually... Not enough resources. You can craft these. Interesting. What is this? You can enter Valhalla with... Okay. A hundred is a lot. I feel like... Mm, if I craft this, is it always like that? You know? What does this say? Very low chance of finding light runic attacks. Level two, level two. What is this one? I kind of feel like I'm going to go with this one. Seems like it's rather strong, you know? If it's always going to be the same. That's essentially, if you want to heal, it's 50 every time, you know? What is this one again? Uh, we got health, which I... Okay, it's also the same. It's Man, that's, I'm actually happy. So the Divine Triumph is what you need to actually increase this further. Somebody told me to increase the difficulty, but I'm not really trying to do that right now. I think what I want to try... Let's go actually increase this one. What I want to try is just keep playing it on like the normal difficulty for now. I think later on I can probably change it. All right, stats are... So it kind of shows you what they think is probably the best stuff. So you got strength, obviously, is 15. Defense are like, eh. Runic, obviously, is good. Vitality, cooldown, I'm surprised, is 10. All right. Let's keep it going. I'm going to keep the same stuff. Unless the new shields in here, I'm really not sure if they add more to it. I like that one a lot. So I'm going to keep that one as well. And as far as this, I like Fury. But we do have this now. The Blade of Olympus. Mm. A dangerous memory. Yo, when we got that in the first video, at first I was like, yo, what is this? It feels familiar. It didn't dawn on me until after the video that it was the Blade of Olympus. I was shocked how much damage it did. So I'm going to go with this one. The only thing is, hold on. Let me read this really quick. Heal a small amount. Okay. Let's see. Restore a small amount by, uh, of rage by parrying attacks with L1 kill. Okay. Yeah. Let's try it out. I mean, it's brand new, so you might as well, right? All right. Here goes. I'm not sure of the video format I'm going to do just yet. I kind of want to try like an hour video, but I'm really not sure. If we get to like a stopping point in like 30 or 40 minutes, then I may just do that. We'll find out. Kind of just go for right now. Never thought I'd be playing this game in 2023, let alone ending the year on it. Think we're good? All right, what are we getting here? Let's see. We get the pick. Blade Rush. Hold on, which one is this one? While sprinting. What does this one do? Hold on. Uh, okay. While evading. Okay. I kind of like this one. What are the Blade Rush Plus? Yeah, the one game this kind of reminds me of, I mean, 
any kind of roguelike game, you have Hades, Returnal. There's so many good ones. I just think a game like this, to have this type of thing, is awesome. Oh yeah, let's try out the thing really quick. Hold on. Was it run and just... There it is. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Wait, that was everybody? I thought that was three, unless I got a collat there. Alright, here we go. We got two things here. Let's see. Meteoric Slam. Which one is this one? The Slam Down. Oh, that's so sick. And we got this one, which does less da- Okay, yeah. Less damage, but it's also light versus heavy. I'm gonna go with heavy. I mean, you want that extra damage. You can also upgrade these. We got... Really? Two out of five? Okay. Ooh, hold on. <laughs> uh, gold Perk Glyph. Okay. Gain rate of permafrost. That is so strong. My goodness. Because when you get those, you'd actually do so much more damage. It also puts a status effect on them. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that. That is a huge passive trait to get this early on. I'm assuming it just keeps going and going, right? <laughs> Alright, hold on. This is always the same, but now there's two doors. If I'm not mistaken, hold on. Which one did we go last time? I'm not sure. Let's just do this really quick. Survival. Uh, yeah, I don't want to restore anything yet. Doesn't make sense, but we got this one, which says... Okay, there's that. We got the upgrade. We should actually... Let's upgrade this. Why not? Probably should save the echoes for, you know, health or rage increase or... Not increase, but really just a refill type thing. We got two ways we can go about this. We also have... Actually, three things. We can also interact with this, but it's also locked right now. So now we have this side. I'm going to go with the other side. We also have... Wait, is the thing down there open now? Hold on, let me double check. No, it, wait. I can't tell if it is or not. No, I think so. Then never mind. My eyes are playing tricks on me. All right, here we go. Hey, doors chosen two of seven. So that was a brand new door. Nice. Uh oh, here we go. Get ready. That does so much damage. Oh, I remember this area, kind of. Right side, it's coming. Easy. Well, that's a new trick. That is so sick. I just realized this thing lasts forever. That's quite a new power, Valhalla's conjured for you. That sword isn't something full of terrible memories, I hope. What do you think? Hmm. Yeah, versus popping like the other rage. I don't know. That seemed to last like it was going to be there for a while. I'm not sure if it's because I was continuously doing damage or what. Alright, here it goes. This is a lot of fun because it adds an element to a single player game that you don't normally get. You know? Especially after it's been out for that long. That image of you in the shrine we keep seeing. If Valhalla keeps pulling it out of your head, it must have some significance to you. Could it be that the idea of being loved and respected is a fair might better than the alternative? Now hear me out, and it's not as though I'm the smartest man alive or anything, but don't you think joining Freya's council could put you in a position to walk that path? To earn that path? Well, that would be a poor reason to accept. Ambition is poison. I love how they talk a lot, and it's kind of like giving, uh... I don't know, just hearing, like, the dialogue back and forth, because I felt like, after a while, you know when you complete a game, like, a single-player game in general, and, like, the characters just stop talking? Like, I remember in Spider-Man 2, when I was going for the Platinum, which I finally got, uh, I remember, like, the podcast, everything just went quiet, and it was, like, the weirdest thing. I'm trying to figure out if I should, because... Can't hop down, can't go over there. I probably could, actually. Let me double check. I just came if I should go to, like, the left door, right door. I feel like we went through one over here last time, so I'm gonna try the one behind me. Let me just search down here one more time. The fact that this is closed off and I couldn't go across... 
Uh, let's see. You can go across here, but you can't go, like, past anything. We got the one chest here. Let's get this. People might not know this, and I don't know if I've ever talked about it, but when the first God of War in 2018 came out, after I finished the actual series, I made some bonus videos. I never got the platinum, but I played that... I don't know what area it was. Where it's like the poisonous gas type stuff where you gotta like get out of there in a certain amount of time. I farmed that hours a day for like weeks. All right, brand new door, let's go. So this is like a dream come true for me. I love this so much. Uh-oh. Really, hopping up here? This might actually work out great because I can ISO one of them. Oh, here goes. 30% faster. Look at that. Makes things so much better. Fun fact, when I put up that first video, it got age restricted, which is why I didn't upload it like on launch day. And you know why it got age restricted? <laughs> uh, apparently, when you wake up, like on the shore area, like I'm yelling, sorry, I took my decibels and they were like bouncing. I was like, uh oh. But, anyways. Apparently, YouTube doesn't like people's heads getting taken off, and I guess they thought Mimir, because he's kind of like laying on the shore next to Kratos, I guess, like on the ground, and it looks like somebody's head got taken off, so I guess they thought that was it. That was like the fastest reversal, which I've never had happen. Usually, I get an automated email, and it's like, hey, uh, video's not okay, whatever, it's against our guidelines. They reversed it so fast. I was actually kind of surprised, so. All right, we got this chest, and... Oh, yeah, we could have used that. Whatever. Actually, should I just pick it up just in case? There's, like, some kind of... I don't know. Bonus thing you get? I guess not. Hold on. Was there any other stuff up here I could break? These don't give anything. Okay, we got the fire over here, which I don't know if it does damage. Let's see. Can you get... No, you can't get close to it. Okay. This is so much fun. The fact that I'm able to play this, obviously I could play on a higher difficulty, but I really wanted to play for the experience of the potential like story stuff, you know? All right, grants a blessing of cooldown when interrupt. Double blue rings attack. Okay, uh, yeah, let's do this one. I feel like that's gonna happen way more often. Just reading the other one, it just gave me like a headache. <laughs> I'm like, you gotta do what now? Getting back to that image of you on the shrine. I'll grant your ambition to be a poisonous motive, but your ambitions are only to help people, not for your own glory, right? Make the world a better, safer place. I think maybe that image of you is symbolic of your desire to walk a righteous path. Valhalla's little signpost. You are sure accepting Freya's offer is the right thing for me, or for the realms? I think we are here to make sure about that, one way or the other. I just feel like we can actually get up there. Okay, we got this door, which I'm pretty sure I've never been through. Well, actually, there's two, so I'm not sure which one I've done before. I probably should have just, like, watched my own video. It's funny, I've already forgotten. <laughs> I played it yesterday. So that door is the one I came out of. That's why it's disintegrated. Let's check this out and just see if there's anything that's actually worth upgrading. Obviously, up these help, two don't really help. Even if it's just for this attempt. Uh, Runic? Let's get that. Hey, let's get it. Stats upgraded. All right. And now we got this one, which normally I would upgrade this all the way, but it's going to go away anyways. Kind of want to save these echoes in case I need to like replenish my health or say I run through an area, use the rage, it runs out, you know, keep it that way. All right, so we got this one and we got the other one. I'm really not sure which one to actually go with. Let me destroy these vases and pots and stuff. You get 10 echoes for that. Interesting. And oh wait, you go up even higher on it. Okay, it's blocked off. Got you. Man, the day was crazy. I was <laughs> just... I was driving with my daughter, <laughs> and uh, my tire pressure came on. I was on my way home, <laughs> and uh, the tire pressure was like... The PSI was like at 33, 34. It was like normal, you know? And I'm going to try this door, but just because... I, I don't know. It's like the other one feels... Like, I feel like I've not been through that one. I can't remember. 
I'm gonna try left. Hold on. Even if I don't get like a new one, whatever. I didn't. Okay, that's fine. We got some ads. Oh yeah, it's just like the same areas over and over, but it's like an, eventually we're gonna get like new stuff, you know. Anyways, the PSI went from like 33 to 24 like in an instant. I got like an alert on the dashboard, and I was like, what? Or maybe it's like a glitch, or maybe it's just like updating because it was cold or something. All of a sudden, <laughs> it goes from like 24 to 18, and like real time I'm watching it drop, and I'm like, oh man. I rolled out my window, and you can just hear the tire <laughs> just hissing air out. I was like, my goodness. It's like different attacks too, interesting. Yeah, it lasts a lot longer than the other stuff, but I also feel like it doesn't do as much damage. Which is fine. I mean, the fact that it's even in the game, I'm excited for, you know. Uh, let me just stop that really quick. Hold on, let's just do this really quick. Ow, wrong button. I swear I still struggle with that. Poison, How you doing? But that was one of the main reasons I didn't put up that part one besides the age restriction. I, of course I always see these afterwards, you know. Um, oh, that door. Hold on. I've never seen the skull, so that's 100% something new. But yeah, I had that, and then I have to, like, call a tow truck and stuff, so that's why I was late putting up the first video for this. It's just wild. Okay, that detonates. I remember that one. What is this one right here? I kind of like that. It's a light attack, too. Yeah, let's get that one. Cyclone of Chaos. All right. Anything else in here? By the way, this game does have music. Sometimes it plays, sometimes it doesn't, but I mostly turn it off like the combat areas. Mainly because, I don't know. YouTube's strange these days. I don't really know what's gonna get hit, what's not, even though people say something's safe, you know? <laughs> I don't like looking over my shoulder a lot on here. I'm assuming this is like a boss, right? Chosen, okay. How you doing? That's a lot of damage. That's pretty cool. It's like we're kind of leading our way there. Easy. I probably could have popped another thing, whatever. It's like I want to, it's like weird. I want to switch between the different weapons based off of the enemy, but the fact that you get, right, I'm trying to like build up the actual abilities, the runic attacks, so I can actually use them against the Chosen, you know? Which might, hold on, is this the Chosen? I oh, it is. There it is. I mean, hop down, hold on. There was health back over here. Let me go back up. What? How you doing? It's so sick using this. It really is. It's like a dream come true, you know? I'd be too far away. Pop this. This is not really a boss, it's just like a mini boss, kind of. Alright. Back up. Got him. Count it, Valhalla. Now we can get to the sands. Okay, let me get this health boost back here. What? It's kind of crazy that I'm playing this game, like, now, you know? I had no idea that I was going to be playing it this year at all, you know? This is kind of tough because a overall strength buff is really nice. Let's watch this really quick, though. Nah. Strength plus runic. I mean, I have to have that, I feel like. That makes everything so much more. Like, my basic attacks do more damage now. My runic attacks do a lot more as well. The runic was like two, <laughs> so it's even better. All right, let's go. Hey, 
Right then, time to ascend to the next area. If you're ready. There's the sands over there. Okay. Let me increase the health really the quick. Term advantage could pay off. For sure. So it's not a full amount, right? 139 out of 140. Okay, I'm definitely going to do this. So it brings it up 40 points right here. I actually just keep it there. That's fine. Uh, let's see. Rage attacks. No, thank you. You know what? Let's, uh... Let's do this. Why not? We got two equipped. It's going to do a lot of damage. That... See where it says suspend game on the bottom? I thought it was the exact way to get out of here originally. But you can actually just pause it. I, I'm pretty sure... Yeah. Return to shore right here. You'll lose everything in this current run. But it keeps going. It'll be like this video never happened, essentially, if I go that route. But I don't want to do that. <laughs> this is kind of why I'm here. These moments right here that may show us something brand new, you know? Like a story thing or a cutscene or anything. Some extra dialogue. I'm all for it. I remember fighting these in the... Uh, Oh no, let's, let's try this out real quick. How much damage is this gonna do? That's so sick. Look how much damage that does. Oh my goodness. This might actually kill without going away. I'm absorbing a lot of damage though, but hoping I can get this enemy before I die. Hey, we're good. That was actually insane. Okay. Chamber of Sacrifice. This is a health thing. Let's see what we got here. Okay, we got... I think I'm going to go with this one. The defense? Look at that. That's a huge, huge increase. My goodness. The last one was two chests in here. We got that one and this one. Okay, yeah, same thing. Oh, hold on. Relic charges. Okay. Limited charge. Okay, relics in Valhalla have extremely short cooldowns, but limited charges. Activated relic with that. Okay, so it's kind of like the thing we like slow down time or whatever. Okay, slow the ground to create an explosion. Poison. Okay, I don't like that. Let's see. I don't know. Uh, applies a mark to nearby enemies. Let's do that one. It's only four charges, though, so. I don't know if I'm really actually going to use these as much. I would save them for like a boss fight, maybe, but we'll oh, see. I see now. They must keep the primordial realms up here on the top shelf. This is brand new. I yet wish to speak about Sigrun. She was eager to receive you mere days ago. What has changed? Oh, don't pretend to be interested in my romantic life, brother. I am interested, and you are evading the question. What happened? Well, after you dropped me off at a longhouse the other night, Sigrun made a cowberry and hazelnut pudding. Of course, I don't eat anymore, so slightly awkward, but a lovely thought. And? Pretty much it, really. Hmm. There is more to this. So it's like we have the boss, and now it almost seems like it's time to progress further into the area. You know what I mean? So I couldn't heal up at all. So to activate this is X. Makes an explosion. I'm not going to worry about it right now. I'm actually a little bit nervous because my health is like halfway. I think it's cool that they created this. Like the fact that this is even a free thing. People still say like, oh, you still got to buy the base game, you know? But at the same time, the game's been out for a while. I don't know what this is about to be. So it's just enemies and like this little fog. Okay. We also got like this, which you can't do anything against right now. Hold on. Think we're good? Yeah! 
What? Roll the wrong way. It's gonna run out. Whatever. All right. I'm really hoping to find some health soon. Spirit Sill. Okay. This feels like like the point of no return almost. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Ah, oh, we're up by those statues now. Judges, did you say? Perhaps the higher planes of Valhalla correspond to the deepest reaches of your memory. It's like we're just going up, you know? Ascending the actual thing. Alright, can you go through here? Nope. Looks like you go up the steps over there. I just want to check these doors really quick. Interesting. Menace is alright. I like this a lot. Same spot as before, so we're not really ascending, it feels like. This is where we get the, uh... Actually, let's try it. This is where you threw across the spear the first time to make this path. And then we're gonna interact with that over there. Alright, here we go. Hello, me again! If I must carry you, make yourself useful. Say what you see in battle. Aye, aye, asshole. I'm hoping there's like a health thing over here. I'm a little bit nervous. <laughs> Uh, it says go that way, but it's closed off. Interesting. Slowly just finding stuff out. All right, we can go there. Let me check this out first. What will he choose? Oh, wow. So if you want to... Here's what I'm wondering. If I want to increase my actual health, what does this one do? Leviathan Crest. Okay, we have like two of those. What does this one say? That would be nice if I could actually afford it. Uh, how about we do this? Let's go to the actual chest really quick. Open these and then we go. I may increase my health at the end just in case. But at the same time... Uh, wait, what does it say? Mass requires sacrifice. So I can't do that. Okay. This one costs... What does this one cost? 250. I can't do anything. Oh, wait. So what does this actually... 250 reward gold perk glyph. You can actually see what you get. What was this one again? Relic. Eh, whatever. I'm gonna increase my health really quick, even though it may be a waste of time. I feel like I'd rather at least do it now than... Yeah, let's just do this. Because I, I don't want to run to, like, the next area and die by accident, you know? Probably a waste. What's funny is I'm probably gonna go back right here, and it's gonna take me back to the shore, and none of that's gonna matter. <laughs> so, let me just collect everything else first. All right, here we go. <laughs> they locked you out. Guess we better poke around the old neighborhood. See what sorts of acquaintances are looking to reconnect. I am so happy I increased the health right there to, like, max it out pretty much. Three chosen. Okay, time meter. Yo, this is sick. This is just like what I thought it was going to be. Okay, each level, the timer elapses. Okay, the timer will halt upon returning. All right. I'm going to just run. This is kind of what I was expecting this entire thing to be like. Floating eyeball tentacles? No, no to this. Oh, so, is this the first one? Well, this one looks easy. Oh. Yeah, easy is what it's all about now. Oh, shield guy. That must be the one Valhalla considers a challenge. Keep trying to do the other thing, but whatever. I haven't done one of these in a while. There we go. Wait a minute. It's a waste, but 
You're enjoying this, aren't you? I helped a little bit. You took out Valhalla's target in case you didn't notice in your killing frenzy. Hmm. Let's get that one. Now this is gonna open. We gotta run. Flight. We don't have enough time really to do everything. Oh, we got a chest over here. Hmm. Just trying to pick whichever. Going as fast as I can. Here we go. And the fact that the timer... I don't know if it, like, said it's going to return us afterwards or what. We're not going to find three enemies, though. Let's go left side. Right side, Enemies are going to get stronger, but I'm not sure if, like... Is it really going to matter? I really wish I had that other thing. This is if we can run past this enemy. Here's the next one. We gotta hurry though. More challenge, more loot, and more holders. Did you need any primitive armed ruffians? Great job, not hurry. You like your Oh, so that was not the end of it. It just increases the difficulty now. Fire behind you. I'm actually fine with that. All right. The more we know now. Now we can get this. Hold on. The first. How you doing? We good? Just in case. I think we're fine. That one's definitely good, but I I don't know. The other one might have been better, but whatever. We got a chest here. What else we got? Let's go to this side first. Ow. I always like the range on this. Obviously, the spear has the longest range. But I feel like, you know, for what we're doing, <laughs> I'm going to do whatever I'm comfortable with because I, I don't want to, like, try the spear. And I got the abilities on this one anyway, so it actually makes more sense to do that. The runic attacks are so strong in this when you upgrade them. All right, where's the last one at? We can go right or left. Hold on. Assuming this is a dead end. Can't go up. Okay, why would this be over here then? I guess to confuse you a little bit. Yo, that's clutch. Let's go. That's the thing in the original spot. Okay. Whatever about the fight is going to be a lot tougher because when we get there, it's going to be... All right, forget all the pots and stuff. Let's just go all the way to the top unless we can't. Okay, blocked off. Got you. So it's right now level two difficulty. I'm assuming it's going to get crazy here in a minute. There we go. Level three difficulty. Come on. <laughs> Just gotta keep doing that. I just, wanna, I just wanna get this and run. Try to get to that next boss before this goes away. Okay, show video. The spear dive. I like that one. This is also good, I'm assuming. Actually, I like this one a lot better. The other one I tried, but I didn't really like it that much. 
All right, this is also blocked. So where are we going exactly? If that's blocked, everything else was no like map or anything. You can't go up here because it's blocked off. Yeah, I'm really worried it's going to get maxed out. And that final chosen is going to be insane, <laughs> you know. Oh, we can go this way now. Yo, here we go. Here it is. Last one. All right, get ready. Hold on, hold on. Here we go. Oh. You did warriors. All up. Seems superfluous, but all right. Oh, the health bar matches the top bar. Nice. Ouch. That did a lot of damage. Hold on, hold on. The jump! That was like no damage. I love it. This might help out a lot. I'm gonna die. That's a nice change of pace. I'm pretty sure I'm dead here. Unless. The miracle! I do believe that's all of them. The way up should be clear. The fact that I'm surviving right now somehow is insane. What is this? I don't think I want to go over there. It's like an extra one. I'm I'm probably good. One hit and I'm dead. I'm actually scared of everything at this point. And things just got harder. Did you forget that haste is a factor here? It's my first time here. All right, buddy. We got all the chosen, so this is like the last thing. Ah, uh, there's got to be health nearby. There has to be. One, like, if I get... I think I see something green over there. I might die on the way there. Though. Let's see what we got. <laughs> let's see. Uh, That's fine. I'm, on, like, on the edge of my seat right now. I'm running past this to see if that green thing is health. It is. Even if it's, it's like a minor health bump, I'll take it. That's better than being at like zero, you know? I'm assuming the only way out of here now is just to fight that main one, you know? I don't see another way. All right, well, this is gonna be bad. Here we go. Incoming back here. I'm dead. Hey, it had to happen, right? I guess we'll see what happens now. Return to shore. Let's see. Let's see what we actually unlock from that. That was a pretty crazy run. I wasn't expecting all that. So right when you wake up. Perhaps a judicious trade with Valhalla would help us get deeper in. Interesting. So it's just like it never happened type thing. Valhalla is a place of constant flux. Adaptability gives us the means to navigate the uncertainty. So what happens if you get all the way and you just can't go any further? You know? Like I wonder did I keep anything from that? We got a little bit further with like the Valhalla story is. stuff, but not too much further. What will you become? Let me I double check this. Board. I like to think of this part as bribing the local authorities. Hmm. It's actually pretty wild. So, craft this. We can do like the Spartan Rage. Here's what I... Hold on. What does this say? Oh, that's... That right there might be the play. Hold on. What is this one? Chests and Rifts. Okay. Resurrection Stall will be really nice as well. Okay, mastery still seems to be like the overall most important thing right now. Uh, health is fine for now. But I do think I should at least... 
put something on each of these. Let's see. Exit combat critically low health. 10% full. Okay. Let's get that one. It's only going to get better. So I'm guessing like 15 or 20, then 30. Okay, here we go. And then this one from chess, which will help a little bit. All right. We got one more run. Let's go. Let's be a, like a speed run right here since we kind of know what to expect. One thing I'm going to take off, though, I like the legacy. I just don't like... I don't know. I feel like you don't get a lot of health, but I'll keep it for now. Whatever. There is the one that just gains health, I believe. I forgot what it's called. Like Valor or something. Why don't you have to, like, really edit the videos? Because it's going to be the same thing over and over in the beginning. So, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. This is kind of like my... What, second time playing this? Which one is this? Freezing thrust where it like hangs still? Oh, it freezes them, freezes them. Okay. Yeah, let's get that one. That seems a lot stronger. We could try like different doors as well, which is a good thing. So that's one thing we got to see is like different outcomes, you know? <laughs> There it is. I couldn't tell if a spear actually stuck right there. Like the first two areas just kind of get you set up for everything. Nice. Now that we kind of know what to expect, I feel like it'd be a lot easier. Hold on. Mountain Splitter. That's the one I do like. What is this one? It's a heavy attack. Man, the cooldown is insane. Let's get that one. Same damage, it looks like. Oh, the cooldown just seemed like ridiculously high for some reason. Okay, Baronet attacks. Not doing that. Yeah, let's get that one. Not using my bare hands. I got three good weapons, you know? <laughs> Unless you're doing like the rage, I guess, you know? A little different. What else happened that night between you and Sam? Well, we stayed up much too late. I told her stories, she told me secrets. She put spirits to my lips, even though I can't get drunk. Then she invited me to watch her fall asleep. Hmm. And the next morning? The next morning, we took a boat along the Lake of Nine. It was divine, brother. The lake was sun-dappled, and the air was crisp and perfect. You could smell the thaw. When did you speak? You know me too well, brother. We were on the lake when I put my metaphorical foot in it. Brand new door. Nice. I remember this area too. Oh, that was my chance. Might change out the shield, actually. The beautiful thing about this, I think it'll be like a longer video format for this, like an hour, maybe more, we'll see. Just around, that's my goal right now. Since it's a lot of the same stuff, and you know, kind of have like minor things that pop up, it'll be different, you know? Whether it's... I feel like I should just save this, you know? I'm gonna save that entire thing, unless I'm just running around and have a lot of extra stuff, you know? Alright, let's see what we got here. I like the more runic attacks, the better, but at the same time, let's get that one. Yeah, we're kind of just slowly gathering everything we possibly can. Okay. This is awesome. Man, the fact that you can kind of re-explore it over and over... We got the two different doors now. We got down there as well. Well, tell me, what happened between you and Sigrun on the lake? Well, she was rowing past where you found her family treasury. Where we learned she cursed her brother over forbidden love. That's right. And as we rowed by, I remember feeling grateful the place was now deep underwater where she couldn't see it. 
And at that moment, she turned to me, and she said, I think, Mimir, I might be smitten with you. I think maybe I want to kiss you. Hmm, indeed, brother. I mean, there's always been more to us than there's been the opportunity to explore. So much unspoken beneath the surface. But I have to name this it. This conversation so. will have to wait. Understood, brother. <laughs> Don't let them keep talking. I thought they may do that still in the combat. Break the chill. All right, we're good. I think the only reason I wiped out last time is because that one boss I took way too much damage on. Like, it was just way too much. I kind of sat there and took an L. I think it's also because the, the blade just kind of leaves you open. You can parry. I just wasn't doing it. Saving everything. All my runic attacks, I'm gonna get them like maxed out. I should not have picked that up. Alright, we good? Alright. While blocking, okay. Let's get that one. I keep seeing that one a lot. Area entered, okay. I think it's worth the price it exacts, brother. You gotta sacrifice 40 health? No thanks. What is this? Cost 40 rage, a weapon glyph? No thank you. I kind of need those two things, don't I? This is the first time I've seen this type of area. I'm pretty sure. Alright, let's keep it going. This is actually just so sick. The you fact that this is even a thing they added to the game is awesome. The part where you spoke. In my defense, I only told her the truth as it struck me in the moment. I told her my feelings for her were deep as Rand's Hall and had been for as long as I'd known her. But just then a kind of revelation came over me. A sudden cold clarity that it was vanishing to imagine that I, as I am, could be enough for her as she is. So I heard myself tell her that I didn't think I could give her what she needed. Now I have married. Pile on, brother. I deserve it. Hmm. Alright, we're out of here. I don't know what's going to happen as far as... Like, if you can beat this... I'm not. I'm still not sure if it's got like an actual true ending. I've heard it does, but I don't really know. Imagine it's like a crazy boss fight. I would imagine it's also timed. <laughs> How's it going? I'm gonna try to keep my rage unless I absolutely need it. On the left. Ow. I might actually use it now. It just does so much damage. Oh, the healing, I got you. Hold on, let me get the one in the back. Or somebody's. Mind you, incoming! Oh, let me stop that. Something is healing them. I'm trying to figure out what it is. Is it the thing flying? It might be. Right side! Ah, wait a minute. No, it's my chance! Ow. Yeah, you gotta like get the actual enemy to killing them away from them. Fake 
we should be clear? Not sure. <laughs> uh, Alright. We can go right or we can go left. This is actually... No, it's a dead end. Never mind. Alright, we're going through here. Looks like the uh, boss time. Okay, which one we do here? This is the same one from earlier. Heavy attack. Then we got this one, which is what I actually enjoy using. I feel like this is probably a little stronger, but it's also got a higher cooldown, so whatever. All right, here goes. All right, same thing as last time. That's so sick. Valhalla's got a bounty on that one. Thank you, watch out. so much. Thank you, watch out. That does so much damage. Of course, I see the tree again. See how fast I was like sidestepping there when I was holding that? <laughs> That's crazy. Blessing of Might. Usually after the first slain one, you gotta like spot where you can heal and stuff. I'm assuming we still have that. We'll see. I gotta pay attention to my surroundings a little bit better when I'm in combat, because there's always like something I can throw or whatever afterwards. Pass should be unlocked now, shall we? Pass should be unlocked now. Which one is he talking about? Oh, the one up there, brand new. Nice. It may be just for this try, but a little assist would be nice. I'm actually gonna do this one as well. Just to kind of keep it, I guess, higher, you know, <laughs> as much as I can. Upgrade. I'm going to keep these all the same. I feel like that's kind of how the game gets you, you know? Alright, sometimes there's like those smaller chests in here. Let me just double check because in that other area, I went under the uh, swinging part. Okay, what is this? Has that always been there? Let me double check. And like the, the small chest is like a different spot last time. Okay, I can't go over there. I got you. <laughs> There we go. That's so much damage. I got it. I'm probably dead. Hold on! Give me two attacks. Hey, wait, did he just get health back? I'm dead. And then the main one? I don't know how I got out of that alive. I'm almost dead anyways again. Which is fine. It's gonna happen eventually, right? We're getting lore on lock two. Even if I die now, I got one more boss down, you know? Okay, uh, now I can kind of see why this is one of the things on there because I kind of need that. Let's see, leaving, okay, I kind of like this one. A wave of shock, it's pretty sick. 
I think we're good. Here we go. All right, same as last time. Here we go. Actually, no, this is not the same. It's a little bit different. Everything's sold out. Of course it is. Wait, what was this? Spirit Tumment. Increasing the base damage. Interesting. I didn't realize that was a thing. Okay. Uh, resources. What does this say? Fleeting Echoes. Man, a Divine Triumph would be so nice right now. But at the same time, it is what it is. Alright, here goes. I'm not sure what's about to happen, but I feel like up to this point, I feel a lot more comfortable with the actual, like, way the game is than I did, like, the first video, you know? I didn't know what was going on. I was kind of just, like, playing. <laughs> like, when a tutorial has a spot where you're supposed to die, you go back to, like, the short area, I had no idea. We're not going up there, okay. Everything over here's got like the ice and frost and all that, so I'm just gonna just use this. Hey, let's go. Look how much damage that does. That's so sick. All right, same as last time. Everything up to this point has felt kind of familiar without, you know, a few extra doors here and there. That's about it. I don't know what's about to happen down here. Okay, this is where we uh, died last time. We got kind of a redemption now. Can we get it done in time? That's the question. We got the two I'm chests back. over there. What a thrill. Hold on, I saved some uh, extra stuff so I can actually heal up here. Your fate Spirit seals. No. Must be nice. What does this say? Launching an enemy has high luck chance. Okay. Shrink. Got you. Ah, uh, man. That is... Hmm. I feel like just keep these. Whatever. Alright, here goes. <laughs> Run it back. Here we go. Hoping it's the same thing with, like, the three bosses. Now that I kind of know where to run, maybe. Yep, here we go. Alright, here goes. I'm gonna just run and because if I can get to all of them before the first bar is over, let's say I don't go after certain chests or whatever. Let's just try it that way, you know? Yeah, I'm just gonna just start going bananas here in a second. Almost. There it is. Might be the right enemy, I'm pretty sure. That was the one, okay. Let's get this and run. Get that defense and luck. Fast scanning, we roll. Wait, what? You can actually go to this one first? Something big I tried to Hold on You're such a 
such a mindless group. We beat. Actually counts, okay. The only problem is right now I'm So it's like you can get the two done pretty quick. Oh my god, vitality and runic that high? Ooh, that's a lot. Really wish I could heal up right now. I'm running like the exact same scenario. If I die, I die, you know? It is what it is. It's like a learning curve essentially. Yeah, maybe, I don't know, like, in the future, what I might do... This is the exact same spot, too. Okay. Difficulties increase to two, but that's... You delay, all right. Kratos. I can hit every single vase or whatever. <gasps> Other side has one. Let's go over there. I think last time I got the three, right? And then I just... I don't know what happened. Oh, there's one over there, too. Okay, so there's... That's weird. I guess maybe you have different ones. Hey, Rocky, focus on the important one. That's one I struggled with last time. Too far away, maybe? That hold him in place is insane. Nice, three out of three. Finally, get on back to the start and ascend or whatever it is. Get that luck. Okay. I'm gonna go back this way and see if we can just leave now. I think last time I just messed up. Heading back to the cage, are we? I guess Valhalla is giving you a second chance. All right, we're back in the exact same spot. Okay. Well, now it's a party. <laughs> One thing I do miss, being able to spam square and have her, like, shoot arrows. Or Atreus, you know? I want to change weapons and stuff in the middle of the fight, but I just... Kratos. Wait, no, don't tell me. The suspense is honestly the only thing keeping me awake. Very nice. Oh, we're not done yet. How you doing? Here's a radical thought for you. Maybe it only counts as a sacrifice. If you give up someone you value, I think we all Why are you? Oh my goodness. Cyclops. Never guess their weak spot. I think I saw a piece of this like on Twitter or something. Did that stagger from that rage siphon? What does it say? Hold on, Greek foes can siphon Spartan rage. Untether yourself, there it is. Man. Try another weapon, idiot. I love your like invincible when you do these types of attacks. Don't let him fall Oh, here we go. Sorry, Cyclops, gotta do it to you. There we go. Here we are. 
Let's see what brilliant move you've thought of. Um, Kratos? <laughs> Surely you're not supposed to. You know what? Never mind. I'd like to see this. Now. Tia. The invitation was yours. I would have signed it. But it was important you come here for your own reasons. Then you're not an illusion. Here in the flesh, old friend. What do you want? I know what you're wrestling with, Spartan. I understand it better than you realize. The shame. The doubt. The question I could find no answer for until I came here. Lifetimes ago. Stepped through that door. What is in there? I'm not here to spoil that for you. Only to help you prepare. Why? Because I can. Because for us, fighting occupies the body while our minds work out the rest. Because you're not ready. Yet. I was not prepared. Why Hold on. Exactly. Are you attacking us? Consider it a kind of trial by combat, Amir. When Kratos can get the better of me, we'll know his mind has done the work. We're actually fighting, which is insane. I don't know what happens if I die, though. That's the only thing I'm worried about. Come on. Come on! An attack of Olympian power! Always impressive, Kratos. Where did he go? A man at war with himself places a deficit upon his focus. He is impatient, emotional, easily surprised. A man at one with himself has a clearer mind, sharper instincts. That man is ready to win. That man is ready to progress. I was not expecting this. I got broken. Hold on. Fight. That's unblockable, Brad. Come on. A little bit of this may help. We'll see. I don't have a lot, but here we go. 
Your mastery of rage is commendable. On your guard! He is tenacious. <laughs> There we go. Well done, Kratos. I yield. Good then. Perhaps you are ready now. Am I? Honestly? Nobody can truly say that but you. Open the door. Oh, man. This is kind of sick, actually. The fact that we actually fought him in the DLC is sick. I hope you enjoy these longer videos for this. I don't know if I'm going to continue this format or not. I feel like for this type of setup, any kind of roguelike game, I feel like really deserves that, you know. But anyways, love you all. I can't wait to see more of this. If you'd like a part three, just let me know. And I'll talk to you very soon. All right. Take it easy.